Okay, on the way. Welcome to this player golf test. Start by taking a look at Rodolfo Pizarro, the 22-year-old center mid who sets at a 74 overall. He was one of my favorite midfielders back in FIFA 16. He was an absolute beast, both in Ultimate Team and in Career Mode for me. But 5'8 center mid slash right back who's right footed with high medium work rates, 4-star weak foot, and 3-star skill. Was the first thing I have to say, this guy is absolutely versatile in Career Mode. He can play in so many different positions for you, especially because that stamina, that pace, decent agility, secondly, is very solid. Uh, the, uh, the marking attack, they're not in the green at the moment. They're at you know, pretty high level, 69 and 70 there. And a uh, pretty good crosser also. So could definitely could play um, out wide for you, both as you know even a, a fullback all the way up to even as a winger um, if you see him fit in those spots. But up to that plus, plus two here, up to the 76. Solid improvement all around, but you can see some more improvement here at the end of the second season. He doesn't have a big gap between his overall and his potential. He's only two points away from his potential now. Um, so it's going to be a bit of a shorter video, uh, which either way, some really good improvements all around mentally the interceptions went up so much uh, which is a bit rare for some of the videos I've done where the mental stats lag a bit but didn't happen with him as his interceptions went up quite a bit uh, which bodes well for him in the midfield could definitely play as well as at fullback you know in, in the defense I uh, will grab himself some interceptions from time to time so he won the ball then played the ball over top perfectly that just really describes how he is he's a perfect two-way player um, especially in the midfield as, as a fullback um, as a winger <laughs> you can play in so many different positions as you'll see when we take a look at the calculations later later on. So this time I played as a fullback, cut back in, and played a great ball over the top to create a little chance there. Um, and now out on the wing again, uh, is going to get all this space, and puts in this easy cross to grab another assist. So you can see him, you know, he's actually, you know, a really good playmaker um, in the sense that he can, you know, get, win the ball for you, then push up and play some perfect passes, and also track back like that and just win the ball for Coutinho, who is kind of lollygagging, but either way, he won the ball in the end. So 81 overall is what you'd cap out at at age 25. So uh, he doesn't have the highest potential, but he's going to be a very versatile player for you. Uh, you can take a look at the player information as well as uh, we'll see if he picked up any specialties. No specialties, but uh, he probably should have engine either way. He's 80 as a winger, 79 as a center forward, 80 as a cam, 81 as a center mid, 81 as a right mid, left mid, 80 as a CDM, 81 as a fullback, and 81 as a wing back. So yeah, <laughs> he's so versatile. He's wonderful. He can pass. He can dribble. He has good finishing and crossing. Uh, the, the long shots are very good. Decent marking and tackling. Physically, absolute beast. A bit of pace and strength and very high stamina. So you can just kind of decide where to play him. You can see it's all those different positions uh, that he is uh, very good at. So I personally think you'd be best um, in the midfield as a fullback or like as a right mid in a 3-5-2 or as a wing back um, in a 5-3-2. So that's personally where I see him best fit, but he can be an absolute beast for you. He can give you cover in so many different positions. So I definitely think you should take a look at him uh, with that, guys. Thanks for tuning in. I'll be signing out now, and I'll catch you guys later.